Multiple companies are teaming up to restore and enhance the longleaf ecosystem across South Mississippi. WJTV's Micah Barnes Garcia got an inside look at the beginning stages of restoration. Mississippi Power, Southern Company, and the National Fish and Wildlife Foundation announced $5.5 million in grants to help bring the longleaf ecosystem back to life. Right now, today, from the 90 million acres that used to be in longleaf, there's about 4 million acres left across the southern United States. The grants will fund restoration to acres lost due to development. To try to return it back to that iconic longleaf pine ecosystem that was here back when the Native Americans occupied this land. Okay, Benefiting so endangered species in the area. So that's going to provide habitat for gopher tortoises, the dusky gopher frog, black pine snakes. These are two great examples here. We're making uh, a measurable impact on these species that are that only exist here. I got a chance to see what wildlife officials consider the perfect site for gopher tortoises, a waif pen funded through the grants. Kathy Shelton with Wildlife Fisheries and Parks has furnished, as you saw, the third gopher tortoise to be placed in the pen and they will establish their own home. Creating a safe habitat for all species to make a permanent home. Officials say their burrows will attract over 300 different insects. In Hattiesburg, Michael Barnes Garcia, WJTV 12. And over the last eight years, more than $8.7 million has been granted to restore more than 87,000 acres of the longleaf pine forest.